Welcome back to Booze and Rocks, where we make cocktails for everyone. My name is David Edwards, and it's great to have every single one of you here today. We are going to make a cinnamon rum iced coffee. Now, you're just getting home from work, or it's the middle of the day, and you want a cup of coffee, but you also want something to drink. So you can take these basic ingredients and put this together in any way, shape, and form that you like. And you know what? It's going to be awesome. But before we get started, let's talk about the ingredients. The first thing you need is your coffee of choice. So go upstairs, brew yourself a pot of your favorite coffee because this will make the cocktail awesome. The next thing you need is a homemade cinnamon syrup. And what I will do is put the ingredients and the method of how to make this down in the description down below for you. The next thing you need is your rum of choice. In this case, I'm using Bacardi spiced rum. Quick FYI, it used to be called Oak Heart. Just saying. And the next thing you need is your Irish cream of choice. In this case, I'm using Bailey's, but if you have access to something else you really like, use that instead. Let's get into it. Now this is a build in your glass cocktail. So grab your glass, whatever choice you want. On this case, I'm using a large tulip size or a stemless wine goblet. Use a tall glass, use a mason jar, whatever. In fact, it'd look awesome in a mason jar. So what we're going to do is grab some ice and we're just going to throw it in here like so. Just like that. Next thing you wanna do is grab your coffee. We're going to put that in first. Allow your coffee to sit for a little bit so it's not super hot, just because we don't wanna break the glass. So we need four ounces or 120 milliliters. And you just pour this on top like so. Next, you wanna use your cinnamon syrup. And for this, we're going to use a third of an ounce or 10 milliliters. Very nice. Now grab your spirit of choice. I'm using Bacardi spiced rum. You could use a white rum or a dark rum. Totally up to you, your preference, whatever you feel will work best when you're making one of these. And for this, we're going to use an ounce and a half or 45 milliliters. And that looks fantastic. So next, we're going to just top it up with a little bit more ice. You just need a couple of cubes. Okay. And, whoops. There I am rushing, nearly knocking things over. Grab your spoon, and you just want to give it a bit of a stir. And this is just to mix the existing ingredients already. Finally, you want to grab your Irish cream of choice. Now I'm using Bailey's. You could use something like Gretzky's number no. nine or O'Hara. However, we're going to use one ounce or 30 milliliters. And you just wanna pour that in there like so. It looks fantastic. It smells fantastic. Let's give it a try. So it smells really good. You immediately get the Irish cream off it, you get little hints of vanilla, and you can smell your coffee. Mm. Oh yeah, that is good. It doesn't taste strong. It's right there. The rum is not overpowering. You just get subtle hints of everything. Easy to drink, perfectly chilled, and exactly what you need. What I will do is I will put the ingredients and the method of how to make this down in the description down below. And if this is your first time on my channel, please hit the subscribe button and make sure you hit that bell notification. That way, every time we put up a new video, you will be notified. And if you'd like to help support the channel, please check us out at patreon.com forward slash booze on the rocks because every little bit helps us to bring these videos to you. You have a great day.